School. I am Ella Dupuy. And I am Sarah Kathleen West. Our scripture for today is from Proverbs. Trust in the Lord with all your heart. Do not depend on your own understanding. Please stand for the Pledge of Allegiance. Place your right hand over your heart and recite with me. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation, under God, indivisible, with liberty and justice for all. Middle school, today is a white week. Third school today is an E day. The official school time is 7:35. It is now time for lower school chapel. Have a great Blue Gator day. Trust in the Lord with all your heart. Do not depend on your own understanding. Also, there's a Veterans Day Chapel on Friday. Uh, three. Eight. Hi, I'm Jay Paul, and today I'm going to be interviewing SK, the Active and Chapel Council member. SK, how is it being on Chapel Council? It's really fun, and it's a way to show God through other people. Is it hard to be an acolyte, but is it fun? No, it's not too hard, but sometimes it's stressful because people don't come on time, and sometimes you just have to go wherever. But it's really fun, and you get to show your love of God. Do you enjoy being a leader to all the other younger Chapel Council members and acolytes? Yes. The middle school dance will be available for the 6th and 7th graders on November 10th. Don't forget to email Ms. Bro if you're bringing a guest. What's poppin' in girls sports? Girls basketball is about to start. Let's see who's playing this year. Our 5th grade players are Molly, Estelle, Alexa, Addison, Claire, Bridget, Soleil, Isabella, and Ellie. This is our 6th graders. Alexandra, Lola, Elena, Lyndon, Mamie, Ava, and Chloe. And now our 7th grade team. Madeline, Ava, Sarah Catherine, Greta, Anna, Sadie, Morn, Quaid, and Peyton. Bye. Bye! Make sure to tune in next week to see what's popping in girls sports. Yeah! Grace is... Grace is forgiving others. Even when they don't deserve it. Hey, you're new here, right? Uh... I was new here last year. It's actually pretty fun to be new. You want to sit with me at lunch? Actually, I'm going to go sit with <laughs> somebody whenever they don't even deserve it. That's cool. Sure. Thanks. Give it. Know it. Speak it. Live Grace. Okay, so today we're going to be talking about Lego League. We're going to be interviewing Alex. What do you guys build in Lego League? We build robots. 
made from Legos to do perform certain tasks. What are you guys building right now? Currently, we're finished building the robot, but we're building attachments for it to complete some tasks. Have you guys ever won any Lego League tournaments? Yes, we won one last year. Cool. Thank you for sharing about Lego League. That's it. Hi, I'm Peyton. And I'm Blaze. Colin Kusher took a stop in our buyer studio last week. He is a sports broadcaster for Channel 15. Here's a short video of what his stop was like. On Wednesday, we have Downtown Open House. This week is a white week. This is this week's birthdays. On November 5th, we have Bo. On November 6th, we have Mac. On November 7th, we have Ava, Joseph, and Jackson. On November 8th, we have Mia. On November 9th, we have Kate. Happy birthday! Tener en gran día a sol de cocodrilo. Have a great Bugator day! <laughs> Problem with a decimal divisor. You gotta know how to divide if you're gonna be wiser. First, multiply divisors by a power of ten. If he's got two places, gotta swoop it again. Make your divisors hold numbers. That's what you gotta do. Don't forget the inside decimal. Cause you gotta swoop there too. Swoop there it is. 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 Put the inside decimal the same number of spaces as you did with the divisor. Don't mess up with the spaces. Raise the decimal up high above it, throw it on. Then it's regular division and you're gonna be fine. Swoop, there it is. Swoop, there it is. Swoop, there it is. Swoop, there it is. Divide, multiply, subtraction, and bring down all what you need to do to take. 